the roots of a quadratic are the values of x where the quadratic equals 0. So for a generic quadratic, such as y equals ax squared plus bx plus c, these are the values of x here where y equals 0. So looking at the graph that we're given on the right-hand side, where does y equals 0? Well, that's where the x axis is, which is the line coming across there. So we're looking for the points that cross that line. So that point and that point. Then we need to read the coordinates of these points off. And they're both going to be of this form. So something, then zero. And then we'll have another coordinate where it's something and then zero. The reason it's something then zero is because, again, y is zero and the y coordinate as a result will be zero. So this one's at minus three. So we have one root that's minus three, zero. And then the second root, this one, is at three. So we have another root. 3, 0. So we could say the roots of this equation are x equals minus 3 and x equals 3, because those are the points where it crosses the x-axis. The intercept or the y-intercept of a quadratic is the point where it crosses the y-axis. In this case, the point here, where y is minus 3. So the y-intercept is minus 3, which is normally the value on the end of the quadratic. So for example, in this case, it's plus C, that would be minus three in this case, so just the constant on the end, which shifts the graph up or down, will be minus three on this one. If you found this video useful, why not try the topic exam on our learning platform? Here, you can answer a series of questions and get instant feedback, both in written solution form and video solution form for every single problem. So if you're still unsure, you can get plenty of practice and have an expert talk you through each problem.